To help conserve beneficial insects, you must first choose a group of flowering plants with bloom periods that overlap throughout the growing season. Then, prepare the area for planting by either mechanically or chemically removing the weeds. After choosing your desired flower mix, add the seed to a carrier such as vermiculite or sawdust as shown here. This will help increase the volume, making it easier to spread the seed evenly throughout the planting area. Once the seed is mixed thoroughly with the carrier, spread the mixture across the planting area, either by hand sowing or with a mechanical whirlwind seeder, making sure the mixture is spread evenly across the planting area. Then rake or roll the planting to help incorporate the seed into the soil. To help the perennial wildflowers establish and to combat weeds, mow the planting during the first year down to 5 to 6 inches relatively once a month. And after the third year, the wildflower planting will be filled with flowers and beneficial insects that are attracted to these plantings. By adding wildflowers to our landscape, we can hopefully conserve beneficial insects, and this may lead to an increase in pollination of our fruit crops, and increase our biocontrol agents such as the hoverfly larvae, which may lead to a decrease in pest insects in our agricultural settings. The more wildflowers, the more beneficial insects, the better our fruit. Thank you.